Hey guys, welcome back to another video from Mantro Beast. So this video is going to be very interesting one because in this video I am going to show you how you can play GTA 5 on your Android device using Mobox Simulator. I know that lot of videos is already being made on this topic but those videos are uh, very confusing according to me and not well and stepwise explained but in this video I am going to explain you all the steps from the beginning that is from installing Termux simulator to enabling async no root to GTA 5 gameplay. Also I am going to show you how you can fix the GTA 5 crash problem in low RAM devices for example if you have at least of 6GB of RAM and if you follow my trick you can also play GTA 5 without crash and with uh, best performance. So without any further delay let's begin with the video. Ok so first let's talk about what are the things that we are going to need. So we need 4 things, first one is obviously the game, the second one is the Termux APK, third one is the Termux X11 APK and fourth one is the input bridge app. So if you have these 4 files then you are good to go and you can get all the links to download those files. Ok so the first step is install this 3 APK. Now after you install this 3 APK, simply go to Mobox GitHub page and there you will see a URL simply copy that URL go to Termux app give the permissions and simply paste here and click enter and just wait for a few seconds all that thing will be done automatically Now after the mobox installation is finished, simply type mobox and press enter. Now we will see this kind of a pop-up menu will appear with the various options. From those options just go to settings option, click ok. Now go to system settings, click ok. And just go to the first option, change fallback resolution and change the resolution to 800 by 600 for best performance and better fps now click on cancel cancel simply minimize now go to termux x11 apk click allow go to preferences and here you have to uh, change few settings that is from display resolution mode change native to exact now change the display resolution to 800 by 600 for uh, best performance in games now just Turn off reset screen while soft keyboard open. Turn on full screen on device display. Turn on force landscape orientation. Turn on high display cutout. Now just turn off so additional keyboard. The Termux X11 setting is also completed. Now simply go to Termux. Type Mobox. Click enter. Now click OK. On first time launching Mobox, it will take a little bit of time because it will automatically install all the necessary softwares that are required to run games inside Mobox Simulator. For example, DirectX, Mesa Turnip Drivers, DXVK, Wine3D, like that. After installation is complete, Mobox Simulator will automatically launch. So our Mobox Simulator is almost ready. Just one simple step is left that is to install async no root script inside Termux in order to achieve maximum possible performance out of any games especially GTA 5. So let's move to the next step. Download this text file and copy the first code. Minimize go to Termux and simply paste it here. And click Y. So done. Our async no root is successfully flashed on your on our Termux Mobox. So now simply go to App Info Full Stop. Now the second step is uh, go to the text file once again and copy the second code that is from export to mobox just copy it minimize go to termux once again just paste it click on enter 
that's it one important step that you should always keep in your mind that before starting mobox you have to paste the following code and click on enter this is a very important step because if you just skip this step and directly run mobox then uh, mobox will run without async enabled and you will not get the best performance out of any games uh, even on gta 5 now simply click ok and wait for mobox to launch automatically now just open input bridge app import any profile i will provide the profile link you can download and import from there for example i uh, right now i'm just uh, using the igi profile pick to test okay this igi one simply minimize open uh, termux x11 and you will see in the top right uh, corner you will see the setting icon will pop up just tap on it and you will see that our uh, control touch control will show up okay now let's try running gta 5 and let's see if it's working or not So as you can see GTA 5 is working smoothly on our Android devices and to let you know guys that this is a 6GB RAM devices with Snapdragon 778G. Okay so uh, now in the final step I am going to show you how you can run GTA 5 on low RAM devices for example if, if you have at least of 6GB of RAM. Uh, then also you can run gta 5 without crash because at least of 8gb ram needed in order to run gta 5 without crash okay because gta 5 is highly ram demanding game so you can follow this setting in order to run gta 5 on low ram devices so simply go to uh, c drive go to users go to the second folder that is user a triple two now here find the documents folder and here you will see a folder named rockstar games simply go here go to gta 5 and you will see a file called settings.xml simply click here double double tap on screen and you will see a menu will appear click on edit and just you have to change few values here okay so what you can do is uh, uh, you don't have to do it manually you can simply download this settings.xml file from uh, already uh, from description that file will already be modified and already uh, will be edited in order to uh, and uh, run gta5 on 